Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, my name is Ubu Gatwin, which is super excited to be here again, guys. And uh, uh, today I have me. But from the positivity to mindset, I'm always happy to, to be, be here. here. Great channel, you know. <laughs> as always, we do nice stuff, interesting stuff here. So like, don't forget to like, put that notification bell on. Like, subscribe, because like, we do great things here. Yeah? Okay, guys. So today we'll be reacting to a video uh an islamic video mm. uh, besides that i've been having a lot of questions yeah i'm not really a question people have been giving it to me back to back like aggressive um um messages i've been receiving mm. like because i'm Igbo and i'm um a christian like why am i reacting to um islamic mm. content yeah that's what i get you know like a lot of the oh. heat is much like so i'm Igbo. can't i learn that i check out all that thing so it's it's crazy where my the kind of <laughs> messages i'm receiving yeah. it's it it's just crazy guys and but i'm like i said i'm here with an open mind and i want to learn more i want to see things from another um perspective perspective so yeah. guys that was a bit of time let's check this out so we're reacting to this is where Jad, Dajjal, Dajjal is chained up. up that's the antichrist right yeah yeah we'll call him the deceitful the, the liar oh, okay guys that was a bit of time Tamim al Dari, who had embraced Islam, he used to be a Christian, embraced Islam, an Arab. He got up and he said, uh, We were in a, a ship and a huge storm hit us. And we were lost until our ship reached an island. We entered the island. He says, a beast came to us on this island. It had so much hair on it that we could not tell the front from its back, which was its head, which was its tail. We didn't know. And we said, Wailaki ma anti. Woe to you, what are you? <laughs> Never seen a creature like you before. And she spoke. The beast said, An al jassasa. They said, Wam al jassasa. What is this al jassasa? And then the beast said, Ayyuh al qawm, people. In taliku ila hadha rajul fi dayr. Come, come to this man who is waiting for you in a dayr. A dayr was known in those days as being like a place where people used to worship. And he said, there is a man who is waiting for your news anxiously. They said, we ran away from the beast immediately thinking it was a jinn. We entered this hut that was set for worship. And suddenly we saw in front of us a person, a man, who was the biggest in build that we have yet to have seen. His arms were wrapped to his neck with chains, like this. And his head and arms were also chained together to his knees, to his legs, like this. So you can barely can just look up. And he's chained up really well, couldn't move. We said, what are you? And he said, you are able to hurt me because I'm chained up. So it's my right to ask who are you first? They said, very well. We are people from the Arabs. We set sail in our ship. And a storm hit us until we became lost and landed on this island. We came to this island and we found this beast that came to us that had so much hair on it. And it led us to you. They said, we got afraid of this man and we, did, we didn't feel safe around him. However, the man said to us, Tell me about the palm trees of Baysan. Baysan is a city in Jordan. He wanted to know whether there were palm trees planted in there or not. We said, what do you exactly want to know about Baysan in Jordan? He said, I ask you, are there more palm trees and have they be filled with dates or not yet? They said, yes, it is full of palm trees and full of dates. 
more than many other places in, in, in what we know. He said, soon its palm trees and dates will become scarce. It will no longer give fruits. Today, really, in Jordan, dates are scarce now. It used to be in history, abundance. Now listen. He said, now explain to me about Buhayra Tabariya. You know what Tabariya is? Which ocean, which sea that is? Okay, the Tabariya Sea. It's also close to Asham. They said, what do you want to know about it? He said, does it have water in it? They said, yes, there is lots of water. He said, soon its water is going to go away. It's not going to exist anymore. And truly today, the water has gone drier than before. Then he asked them, he said, tell me about Zagar Fountain. Zagar Fountain, probably about three days journey, if you wanted to walk away from Jerusalem, Beit al Magdis, that's where that fountain is. So basically, in what we call Israel today. They said, what do you want to know about this fountain? He said, well, is there a large fountain and do people plant a lot of vegetation around it and it gives a lot of water yet? They said, yes. It's all got a lot of water and its people plant a lot. Tell me about a prophet who is Ummi, who is illiterate, cannot read or write. What has he done? They said he has come out in Mecca and now he lives in Yathrib, in Medina. He asked them, have his people fought him? They said, yes. He said, what did he do? They said he was driven out by his own people. But he went to another Arab, the Yathri people and those who embraced Islam with him and they obeyed him. This man said to them, really? Has that really happened? They said, yes. He said, Ama inna khayrun lahum an He said, behold, it is better for those people who obey him to keep on obeying him. He's actually supporting the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Now I'm going to tell you about myself. Inni ana al-Masih. I am Christ. Isa alayhi salam. Wa inni ushaku an yu'dhana li fil khuruji fa akhruj. He said, now very soon, based on the signs you've showed me, I'm going to be given permission to leave and I'm going to come out. Fa asiru fil ard. I will walk throughout the land. Fala ada' qariyatan illa habattuha fi arba'ina layla. He said, there, isn't, there wouldn't be a village or a city or a place on earth except that I would have reached it all in 40 days. The whole world in 40 days. غير مكة وطيبة All except two places, مكة and طيبة, Medina. فهما محرمتان علي كلتاهما He said they are both forbidden for me to enter. Now when we say he enters, it means he conquers, it takes over. He owns it. كلما أردت أن أدخل واحد He goes, every time I wanted to come into one of them, an angel will stand guard holding a, a sword and he will prevent me from entering Mecca and Medina. Al Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam started grabbing his, his, uh, his stick and sort of he put it close to his, to his hip sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and then he began to bang, to hit the ground with it, like this. But he was sort of tense, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Something very important. He was really tense about it. And he hit the floor and he said, Ala hadihi tiba. Behold everyone, this is tiba. Meaning he's pointing, this is Medina. He's in Medina, he's saying, this is tiba, which you are in right now. He said, didn't I tell you that this man will come out and not be able to enter this land? They said, yes, Ya Rasulullah, because he had told them a lot about it before. He said, the hadith of Tamim and Dari, wallahi amazed me as he told me about him. Because it's the same as what I used to tell you about Mecca and Medina. Behold, a Dajjal is somewhere in one, near the oceans, in one of the, the, on an island somewhere towards the east, the east of Medina. Somewhere there, he said, in one of those oceans. In Qibal al Mashriq Mahu, towards the east, somewhere. So even the Prophet doesn't know exactly where he is, but in that direction. So he's close to the Middle East at the moment. 
So Allahu A'lam, a Dajjal will first arise in Asham, in the Middle East area. And which gives a lot of, you know, sense that the Jews will be the first to follow him because they are waiting for their Messiah to come. They don't believe that Isa alayhi salam was it. And they don't want except Muhammad sallallahu alayhi salam. So they'll be the first to follow a Dajjal. They feel, they say, he is the real Isa. As for the Christians, they believe in the coming of Isa alayhi salam. Because they've mixed up their scriptures, they will think that this is the man. And because he will say, I am Isa, they will ask for him, alayhi salam, they will ask for miracles and he will do these miracles. Some of them won't be convinced. See, afterwards he'll say that I am God. Ana ilahukum. And then they'll say, what proof do you have? He said, only God can raise the dead. He said, okay, what if I raise your parents from the dead? They said, yes, we'll believe your God. So he will be able to get the jinns, the shayateen, to work for him and he will raise them to become, you know, to look like their parents and they will speak to them. And so the people, non-Muslim people and the weak Muslims will follow him. Are you tired of all these annoying ads on YouTube? Are you worried that a haram video might pop up? Well, the one is slam. Wow. Hello? Mm -hmm. It's scary. <coughs> it's really scary. Like in the last days, things are going to happen and how people are going to be deceived, how mm -hmm. if we're not careful, we could be among them. And, you know, and the fact that we're not taking it serious, you know, mm -hmm. everybody's chasing their daily bread and not even constantly looking out to God or looking out what God is saying and looking at the scriptures, reading about this, because we don't read. That's why I say, oh, if we read, we have ideas about all these things, but we yeah. don't. Yeah, like seriously, because um, one thing about the Dajjal, the, the deceiver, is like the prophet talked about him a lot. He even gives some description. He will have one eye and there will be a mark here, a writing Kufu, which means denial of this believer. And so you see that there are a lot of Things, science. yeah, yeah. God, uh, God said about, and the prophet mentioned about him, and science as well. And it will come to a time like even wo women will be attracted to him so so much that even the believers will try their wives, I think, with their mothers. I don't know for that one at home. So like they'll be saved. And the prophet said, if he is around when the dajjal come, he will fight the dajjal. But he's no more around, so we have to be careful. I think we have a surah that you sometimes. We read like it protects you from the Dajjal when he comes, he won't be able to convince you. He'll be walking with something like he'll a deceptive thing, like you see something like fire. If you follow him, he'll the water is here, cool water. If you are a disbeliever, you see, I'll put you into hell in the fire. So, but it's just like it's not fire. If you drink from it, it's something cold, but he that's the way he deceives people and he kind of like performs miracle that you think, like, oh. Oh, he will plant trees today, he will grow today. He will command the dead to wake up. But it's not the dead that is waking up. It's like using it devils yeah. and they will come speak to you. So all those things. So imagine, just like, it's it's more scary than even how we think about it. Because like, when you look at it, now if someone is performing a miracle right now, you get, you have a lot of people that is following that those people. Yeah. And I don't know, like, not like I'm trying to discriminate Christianity, but like, you have some churches they go to. If you don't perform miracle, people will are not plenty there. If they preach the real word of God, people don't go there. Oh, that's the truth. That's, that's, that's a fact, you know. Hmm. You could see today, that's why you see today, this church is booming. People are rushing to the next day, and that person is rising. And you hear some things they do there and you say these people have brains to think this is like like yeah. things that you'll be wondering how like how these people subject educated people for that matter will do nasty things you know like I just, don't they read don't they understand but because of miracles because of science mm -hmm. they are looking for this they are looking for that so they keep jumping from fire to post you know from yeah. fire pan to fire and mm -hmm. from pillar to post mm -hmm. because they don't know what they just they don't know the signs they don't read they don't blindly, like yeah they, they, they see miracles as the main thing about religion or yeah. about god but no that is a supplementary thing first yeah. is to believe in god and yeah. god can be you can be in your in your in your, in your, in your bed and god decides to heal you from your bed yeah and you have some people the miracle they are the things they are doing is like just tricks because yes. they don't do it with ordinary things they go to like voodoo stuff exactly. and all of that you know and just things don't last yeah. yeah, a lot of people go through like in terms of hiring people for them to wake up and mm, like for yeah. the dead and like it's crazy. A lot of tricks and and 
games and jokes, you know, it's just for money. Just for money. Yeah. You know, and it's it's sad that people at this point in time are deceived. Then imagine when the Dajjal or the Antichrist comes, Aye. it will really, really be easier to deceive a lot of people. Yeah, yeah. You know, so it's just it's scary. It's it's scary. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. So thank you for coming on this one. I really appreciate I, coming here, bro. It's yeah. always nice. This channel is full of vibes and all. Okay, I want to say very thank you, my subscribers. Also, don't forget to follow the Positive Mindset on YouTube. Amazing content creator, amazing reaction videos. Go check him out and if you're new here also do not forget to subscribe before leaving here turn on the notification buttons yeah. so that when i post new videos you'll be alerted and also if you have any suggestions drop that in the comment section interact with me we will definitely do that and if you have any videos you want us to ask, still drop that in the comment section i'll yeah. also do that to that and please if you have a particular video you want me to react to drop the link so i'll be able it will be easier for me to search out the video to locate the video uh -huh. so yeah i'll react to that for you guys so come away next time